Hey guys, um, I put on false lashes and this is going to be how to look a porn star. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> it's going to be how to fill in to make your false lashes look more dramatic and pretty. So yeah, uh, the first thing I'm going to cover though is um, how to take off like excess makeup around your lashes or lash glue. I'm using Avon Moisture Effective Eye Makeup Remover Lotion. I just like to squirt this out on something, so I'm doing it on a bronzer cap, and my big mirror like crashed, so I'm using a little mirror, and a little bit of this actually goes a really long ways, as long as you get like all the excess glue off. should come off actually like kind of in a sheet. It's really kind of thick. It'll be like little beady bits that come off and that looks a lot cleaner. And do the same for the other eye. Plus this helps if you have really bad like raccoon eyes. I'm gonna fix that. which is just going to be a black eyeliner and this is also Avon, it's the black glimmer sticks that I told you guys I got and just all over up to my crease like this is actually going to be really patchy because like I don't care if it's really filled on do black or like any other color, you can use any color really with this I'm just doing what I find works best. And then you can smudge it with your finger. And if you're nervous about getting close to like the band of your lashes, you can use a Q-tip, which I always keep nearby for when doing my makeup. later but you can just put it away for now and I'm going to use a paddle brush and a black eye or yeah black eyeshadow and I'm just using this color here and this is the color concept color palette and I'm going to pack this on the area because you want it to be like kind of really black. So they're both black now. And next one I'm going to do is take a defining eye brush. I couldn't remember the name. And take the black again and go fairly close to the band. If you're comfortable enough with it, go right over the band. Because it should be like blended in so it looks like a lash line. And if you get it up out of the crease, don't worry because we're going to clean that up later. So I'm going to clean that brush out and I'm going to go in with Plum Crazy from Victoria's Secret. Uh, is this color? It's a purple. It's like dark amethyst or dark plum, whatever. And I'm going to go close to my crease with this. Pardon my dog barking. to 
get another Q-tip. Take the eye makeup remover, and I'm going to do like completely cleaning out my crease, like above my crease where the makeup gun is, where we don't want it. And a little tip is that as you go, spin the Q-tip, and that'll help a lot. the clean one, there's the messy one. Clean obviously looks a lot better. And if you want to know the exact point that I'm cleaning it off is probably about half of an inch above the crease. Maybe like a quarter inch. cleaned up now. So I'm going to apply this champagne color from Mary Kay and it's an icicles in the color vanilla. And this is going to go all on my brow bone. I'm going to the mirror to the side so you guys can see. So I'm just going to use this as a brow highlight. And I'm going to use a little fluffy brush. This is just an art brush and it's a number five. It's a fluffy one. And I'm going to use a champagne color. And cover my brow. using a, a blending brush and I'm going to blend those two together. So I'm blending them. Just so it looks a little bit prettier. Haggard. So, next what I'm going to do is apply mascara over my false lashes and my lashes to blend them together. And any lashes, like false or real, that fell during this time will now stand back up. So, they stand back up. Um, do this for the other eye. I'm going to give you guys a little tidbit of advice. Um, if your lashes, which they shouldn't, but if they peel off and you're in public, what you can do is uh, take a blending brush with you and just blend the makeup down and it should work. So now, since my eyelashes are dry, I'm going to take more makeup remover and clean up my inner corner and underneath my eye.
finish this look out, I'm just going to apply some eyeliner to my waterline and then put some uh, mascara on my lower lashes. I'll just show you what the finish I looks like. Compared to the not so done eye. So that's what it looks like. I think it's pretty, so yeah. Uh there's the finished eye if you want to keep watching this. I'm just gonna finish, you know. Putting on mascara. Or aligning my She parks at the gas workers because we live near where some gas workers live. And she works with Molly! She gets a little wound up. She's a little dog, too, so. Whatever floats her boat, you know. Little dog. Thick rub. <laughs> Alright, guys. I'll see you later. Finished look. Woo! Alright, bye.